Hey, you guys. Welcome to CLC Creations. You're one and only a motherfucking Taurus in the building. Coming to you guys with a PSA announcement update on Wacky Wednesday. Dealing with people, places, and things. Could be my situation, your situation, somebody else's good, bad, or the devil work. Could be God work. Involving love, hatred, jealousy, aspiring, communication, children, marriages, betrayal, backstabbing trustworthy it could be anything coming across my channel if you are new here welcome welcome glad to have you hi to my haters aka clones and hi and thank you to my old supporters that been here from day one a1 with your motherfucking girl until the wheels fall off in this bitch room room beep beep i do have other platforms and services and other ways to communicate with me Go check me out on Instagram, Facebook, TikTok, and Twitter. I do have a Google app number, email address, and a personal information. So you can better reach me for your services or assistance. Go check me out on my community board. I will upload the email address on the community board. It is in my bio and my description. If you want to get information on my layaway and my raffles, and you want to participate because it's the holidays and you're trying to get something free, come check your girl out, okay? Hit me up on my community board let me know it's you. Or just give me your information through my email address that I have personally for you YouTube people. And y'all will be aware of what's going on. I am not here for clout. I am not here for likes, comment, or subscribe. I'm not here for any donations or anything like that. I get my money and stuff off of YouTube. Or any of my platforms I am a one-stop shop and none of that shit matter to me I am really thankful that y'all are giving me the views and the likes and stuff that y'all are giving me if it's in your energy or your heart or your mind or your body and soul feel free to do it just be respectful when you do it when it comes to me I'm gonna treat you the way that you treat me so y'all excuse the noise I um outside you know as you can see I'm outside so excuse the noise in the background I told y'all I'm on the busy street y'all gonna see cars motorcycles all type of stuff going by and I love it you know what I'm saying because it's very peaceful in the same way is very nature is very like humble it's like the best best feeling ever okay so you guys I'm not gonna shut the fuck up or sit the fuck down nobody's gonna make me if you don't like what's going on on my channel exit the motherfucking building because i'm gonna speak the truth and i don't care if it triggering you and that's just me as an individual person so i do have a seven day of the week topic story time message or blackout I have Motivated Monday, which is Air Signs, Terrific Tuesday, Wacky Wednesday, Thirsty Thursday, Fantastic Friday, Sensitive Saturday, and Satisfying Sunday. Satisfying Sunday is my favorite zodiac sign. Earth and Fire. I'm an Earth sign married to a fire sign. I love it. So, you guys, I am just loving it. It is Wacky Wednesday. And if y'all have any like stuff y'all want me to sell or anything that y'all want me to do as far as my channel just let me know okay so we just gonna get into it so my terrific tuesday was wonderful y'all <laughs> my friend came over after we had negotiated about it when we was at the nail salon a couple of days ago so she came this is her first time coming to my house and stuff like that. And she loved it. And she was like, oh my God, you could do wonders with this house. So I was telling her the stuff that I was going to do. Me and my Aries P places and things by making it pop more. So um, I did a double shift last night. I always do double shifts, me and my Aries P places and things. Along with preparing everything for Christmas. I'm going to cook for Christmas. And I decided on um, I'm going to feed the homeless for Christmas. I fed some of them last night on Terrific Tuesday. I just felt so good. I told y'all I give back. I'm not that type of person. I said that on Christmas I'm going to do them like some little bags and put some hygiene stuff in there. 
in some little snacks and stuff, you know. That's the type of person I am. I gave them some snacks and stuff last night. I gave them some chips and some juice and all that. And my friend and my godparents and everybody was like, Taurus, what we going to do with you? You know what I'm saying? So, I want us to, like, clear our mind, body, and soul from people, places, and things. Whether it's my situation or somebody else's good, bad, or the devil work, let's turn our negativity into a positive situation. Let's stop and think before we take action. I want to thank the men upstairs, my husband, my children, my godparents, my friends, and all you guys for y'all love and support on and off my platform, whether it's business related or not. Let's keep that energy. So, when my friend came over, she had brought some gifts and stuff like that and some food and stuff like that, and I told her I was okay, but she felt the need that since I've been there for her for three months straight, that she felt the need that it was her duty to do so but I told her we was good you know what I'm saying because me and my husband people in my circle work hard and then I gotta tell y'all when she came through my house she was like oh my god Taurus oh my fucking god this is a beautiful ass house I like the setup I like the porch I like everything about it you by yourself you know you don't have no bitter ass neighbors and shit like that that you had and stuff like that I just feel fucking good. But you know what kind of dawned on me, right? It's a family situation. I know everybody has toxic people in their family. People that's jealous, just like a regular hater. You know, they're jealous, they envy, and stuff like that. And I told y'all, I went off on my siblings. And now, that Christmas coming up, they know that me and my Aries, we play stay and go all out when it comes to food and shit like that. Like, we don't count on no motherfucking body. If people do it, if people do it for us, they do it from their heart. Like, we will do it for somebody else. Like, we've been doing that. And my siblings was, like, asking a person we look up to, like, it could be a grandma or a mother figure or auntie or something like that, asking them, are you cook cooking on Christmas? So this elderly person was like, nah. So the siblings was like, well, what are we going to eat for Christmas? So they was like, oh, y'all worrying about Christmas, right? Don't y'all get food stamps? Don't y'all get child support? Don't y'all get SSI? Don't y'all get Section 8 and all that? This elderly person was like, I don't get all that stuff. So, why do I have to prepare Christmas? And every time we prepare Christmas, y'all and the tourists always getting in fights. So, the person was like, nah, I'm not doing Christmas with nobody this year. You know what I'm saying? And they was like, the tourists and the Aries, the only one brought gifts. The tourists and the Aries always bring food or drinks or something. Y'all never bring shit, but y'all want to eat, 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 right? This is what the person was saying to me on the phone. So, as the day went by or whatever on Terrific Tuesday, I was hanging with my friend at the house or whatever. So, the siblings going to say, where well, is the Taurus and the Aries cooking? And the person was like, I don't know. They cook every year. I don't know. And then the older person was like, why does it matter? What y'all trying to use, the Aries and the Taurus? <laughs> so you guys, it's kind of funny, right? Because these individuals said they wasn't going to do this for Christmas. They wasn't going to buy gifts and this, that, and the third. All of a sudden, this individual that everybody looks up to, this older figure gonna call me and say Taurus I need help I need a loan I said for what you know what I'm saying like for what now this older figure told us that they're not doing Christmas so they called me back on terrific Tuesday like four or five hours later after they done got off the phone with me and said what the other siblings said and this and that and the third so I said Huh? They said I need a loan. I said a loan for what? 
oh, I'm finna do Christmas. I said, you finna do Christmas? I said, but you just told me you weren't finna do Christmas. This person brought up my siblings and said, well, everybody ain't gonna have nothing to eat and I know that you and your area's gonna go all out, this and that and the third, and I wanna know if you can help me with your siblings. I said, no. I said, no. And y'all, it was so hard for me to say no because I never said no to this person before. But after speaking with my godmama and my friends and my husband, they was like, Taurus, bae, goddaughter, say fucking no. Because you always get to do the best in every situation and then everybody feel like they can shit on you and your Aries and shit like that. So my husband said he was tired of that shit. So... I said, why is I'm buying turkey wings? Why is I'm buying ham and stuff like that? And me and my Aries are doing our own thing, right? So they was like, it's for your um, family. I said, what family? I said, my family lives with me. I'm like, what family? I said, my family, my godparents and them come to my house and shit. So what family I'm talking about or you talking about? They talking about, oh, your siblings and stuff. I said, man, I'm not feeding them. Fuck no. I feed my friends, my godparents, and all of them, but I'm not feeding my siblings. I'm going to tell y'all the straight up truth. Because they get food stamps and shit. Me and my Aries don't get none of that shit. You feel what I'm saying? And why do we have to do it? But they could not come to us and say, do y'all need a loaf of bread? Do y'all need this? Do y'all need that? But y'all want me and my Aries to do turkey wings and hams and shit. No, we're going to buy it for our own motherfucking house. But how I told this other person, this higher figure, I said, you blown me when you said siblings. I said, I would have did it for you. I said, I would have made a plate at my house and give it to you, but I'm not feeding them. Then they was like, why Taurus? Why? You know what I'm saying? Don't be like that. It's Christmas. What the fuck? I said, are y'all fucking serious when y'all just said y'all wasn't buying gifts? that y'all only had gifts for certain kids and shit, but y'all want me to feed my motherfucking siblings that I don't fuck with over jealousy. They don't like me, and I'm gonna tell y'all the truth. They don't like me because of how I handle shit, how I stand in my motherfucking power. Everybody don't like that I am determined when it comes to shit. People mad because they can't run over me. The only person I will let get stuff and ask for stuff and don't mind doing shit is my people in my household, my circle, and my mom. And my godparents and shit like that. You know what I'm saying? So, I never say no to them. And this older figure, no, I never said no to her. But I had to, y'all, because you trying to use me to help fucking people I don't fuck with. I don't talk to. I don't do nothing with. So, she gonna try to throw it off to my son. Oh, no. They just gonna come over here and get gifts. They ain't gonna eat. How the fuck? You just being a hypocrite because you just said my siblings. Then when I said no, you said, oh, they not gonna get a plate. They just gonna get their gifts and leave. Y'all need to learn how to do y'all stories right because I'm a fucking tourist. I listen. And I know you trying to shit on me. So I said no. So the tour, so the tourists, people, places, and things, haters, whoever meant what the fuck they said and this person gonna say well it was my birthday yeah it was their birthday yesterday on the 13th I told them happy birthday right and that's how they tried to butter me up saying they don't want no gift and stuff they just want to cook no you want me to help provide the food when they not gonna bring anything and they just gonna get a meal nah I feed the homeless because the homeless people is more appreciative, more respectful when it comes to shit. They ask to cut my grass for a little bit of nothing. They watch my house when me and my husband are at work. Even though we got cameras, they do watch our house and shit. You know what I'm saying? So we get them hot meals and shit. And the man said... Excuse the noise. I waited to that car, that truck go by. The man said, I'll work for what I want. I don't want nothing handed to me. That's how I am. 
they trying to fucking use somebody. Nah, fuck no. So I had called my get um my godparents and my grandparents and stuff. They was like, what you gonna do? Did you talk to your Aries? I said, yeah, I talked to my husband. And my husband was like, hell no. Nah. Fuck no. Because they were just trying to play like fuck them same siblings. That's what they were trying to tell me a couple of months ago and shit. Like fuck them siblings and this and that. They don't mean you no know, justice and they don't mean you no know, purpose towards da 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 da. But then you gonna come and ask me for food for them. Nah. My husband laughed. My friend laughed. They were like, they was just complaining about they didn't have money to do this and that. So how they was going to do Christmas? They wanted me and my husband to do it. But we ain't doing it. I said, I'm feeding the homeless. Fuck that shit in my family and the people in my circle. I'm not doing all them extra favors. So they said, but you got it like that, Taurus. You know what I'm saying? You can afford them. Oh, well, it doesn't matter. Shit. And my friend was like, Taurus, I'm going to help you, but don't be helping them. I said, I'm not. Y'all trying to use somebody. Hell no. Nah. But other than that, I had a good terrific Tuesday. I've been getting blessings on top of blessings on top of blessings. And I had to say no. And then they tried to say, oh, I was going to invest in you, Taurus, every month. But my funds is kind of low, so I couldn't do it. This is what the other person was saying. Then trying to get the food from me and say the reason why they need the food from me so they can give me the investment that they supposed to give me for my business and all that. I don't want it. Because it's basically like if I do give you the food and shit, you ain't gonna do the investment. You gonna try to run with that shit. And you know that the siblings and stuff don't fuck with me. You know that we don't fuck with them. And they don't shit it on this same person we look up to. They don't shit it on her. But she wanna feed them. Fuck no, that's crazy as fuck. Like, that's some real crazy ass shit. I'm sitting back thinking, me and my husband, I'm laughing and shit. I'm like, wow, this is fucking crazy. This is really fucking crazy. I like, this can't even be happening, Captain. But anyways, that was how it went. I had a good motherfucking time on my terrific Tuesday. I cleaned up, I cooked. I did all that shit with my Aries people staying. Went to work, did a double shift. And now I'm trying to pick a day to go Christmas shopping. I ain't even pick a day yet. I ain't even gonna lie to you. I ain't even pick a day yet. You know why I ain't pick a day? Because money and shit keep rolling in. And it's not over with. So I don't want to just go and then have to go back out and shop. I want to get everything at once when I do my shopping. So, I don't know why people be trying. And everybody said, Taurus, you got a good ass fucking heart. My enemies and haters are never gonna see that. They never gonna see that. You know why? Because we got bad blood towards each other. So they gonna paint me as the bad guy. Because they can't outdo the situation. They can't step on my toes or my neck. They can't do anything. Only thing they could do is look from afar and talk shit. And try to slander my name and shit. But you can't slander my name and shit, motherfuckers. If y'all are already out there in the public eye. Y'all can't call me this and the third if you already doing it yourself. You ruining your own reputation. Nobody else is doing it. Nobody else is calling y'all sorry moms, lazy, whores and all that shit. Just to be calling y'all that shit. Y'all doing it in the public fucking eye. And all the people that I'm talking about. They put men's before their fucking kids. That's why I can't fuck with them. Even my siblings. My siblings will do for a drunk, alcoholic, motherfucking person. And then get mad because I have a hard-working ass husband that provides. And they want to blame me for it. Oh, Taurus, you think you better than us. Oh, Taurus, this and that. Okay, if y'all want to lay down with bombs, prostitutes... If y'all want to lay down with junkies and pill poppers, if y'all want to lay down with those type of people, how is that my fucking fault? Bitch, I have standards. I have motherfucking standards. I have do's and don'ts. I will and will not accept. And them street type of motherfuckers, I don't accept. Crackheads, all that, I don't accept them as a relationship. 
I wouldn't sleep with a crackhead or none of that shit or a cokehead or none of that shit. I wouldn't sleep with a powder head or drunk or none of that. I wouldn't sleep with none of them type of motherfucking people, but I would help them. And y'all getting mad of the company that I decided on I don't want to deal with. At the same time. You feel what I'm saying? So you guys, um, I gotta get some work done to my house. As y'all can see the van pulling up. That's my handy person. We finna do some work to the house and shit like that. You know, I gotta finish my fence and shit. So you guys, I'm finna just close it out before he um come. But y'all can't get mad of the company that y'all motherfucking keep. That don't make me a bad person because I choose not to have that type of company around me. I have motherfucking children and it's a safety cautious, okay? So I will see y'all in another one on a wacky Wednesday. Y'all enjoy. Y'all be blessed and I hope y'all had a terrific Tuesday. I'm finna go. Bye.